What's up guys, it's me Simon here. I'll be taking over today for the Sailor Adventure Vlogs. Right, because Iman has given me the chance to go and try out. So I'll be your guide today. So we are here preparing for the Koto. Right, we'll be going to punch in for, for the fans. Say hi Iman. Yo sir, sir. For, for today's episode, Simon's covering. So we'll, we'll, we'll be rolling along with you guys, right? So just follow me on these adventures. We are going to watch today Tiger Mother versus Rice Sea Sailors. So come join along.
table clash between Sailors and Tanya Paga. Let's go, Sailors! go by Diego Lopez let's go let's make it 2-0 all right 1-0 is not enough all right because we because Tanja Paga has been known for coming back and have been unbefitted so let's do it come on one more give it a try come on There is Anu in the lineup now. Uh, so they, they have put Anu in to counter Zukic. Uh, Zukic sorry, uh, because he's going to be very potent. So looking from the field, you can see that uh, Anu is actually man marking Zukic himself. Right? So let's hope this continues and we stop the Tanjo Paga attack. But right now we're currently leading 1 0. So let's go, Sailors, come on! Now the home side of the stadium is there, so you can see where the crew is. But here at the away side, you'll find quite a fair bit of Lions E Sailors fans and supporters here as well. All coming here to watch the game. This is Tanjo Paga fan, what's up? Alright, so here at the here at the away side you can see quite quite a bit of Lions E Sailors fans. Yeah, apparently they are all here to watch. Not saying that there are no Tanjo Paga fans, but um, even on this side as well you can see people coming watch. So Tanjo Paga is playing quite well today. Alright, they have quite a big uh, fan group coming in. Alright, uh, the the Jaguar Force. Hashtag, uh, thank you for coming. All right. And you can see the amount of people here watching the game. So, come and check it out. What a chance for Kim Shiro. Hey, come on Rev, give a cut. Uh, come on. Anyway, so we've been doing well. Uh, I think that we can we can do much better in this second half. Uh, attacks has been quite we've been attacking, but not clinical enough. We have to take our chances and you know provide more accuracy. But I think overall we're doing well for the first three minutes. Looks like there's another attack, attack pending up. Let's go.
on second goal after header. Oh my gosh. 2 0. and one goes from Shadan. We played a really extremely good first half. I mean, we played back to our attacking football that we've been playing last season and sorely missed. Plus, we were very good at the back. I would say that this is one of the best performances we had uh, against an unbeaten team. There is the Jaguars itself. And you know, I can't wait for the second half. I don't know how about the fans, but I think that this uh, first half was really, really good. We could have made 4 nil or even 5 nil if we took our chances. But if we play like this, we can win. What about you? What do you think? What, what do I think? It's 3-0. I don't think I need to say anything. But uh, me and Callum have this ongoing inside joke for the longest time. We said that the Steelers are going to get a 5 nil win. Hopefully today is finally the day we get a 5 nil win. Callum, yeah. if you're saying anything, uh, KL, we're going to get a 5 nil win. All Let's right. go, Steelers! Alright, well done. All right, Ethan, how do you think what our first half went? What a, what a first half this was, man. 3-0. Like, it's like the Vanessa game. You know, two home games in a row. We go 3-0 up at, at half time. It's like, you don't get these things very often, you know. And hopefully, uh, we get a few more goals, and it's a good, it's a good way to make our make, make our point, uh, make a statement, you know, ahead of the Champions League. Next Friday, guys. Next Friday. Uh, it's a good Friday. It's a public holiday. We are playing for all. I'm more hyped for that actually. But let's let's hope we don't we don't cost the the same thing that they did and score back three goals. Ah, uh, we hold our second half. Please don't do a Tampanis. Please don't do a Tampanis. How about you, Lucas? Great. It feels great. The atmosphere is great. I think the players have been hardworking so far. But I, it's, it has been a great half. I hope more goals will be coming. So, no more Taylor's. Alright guys, we'll catch you once the second half starts. In the meantime, we'll be signing out for a bit. See ya! Oh, Alright, welcome back. Second half of the way, we just have a substitution for Maxine Lestin. So, it's in. So, let's start the second half. This is going to be interesting. Alright, so, let the kick off again. We have kickoff for the second half. Let's go, sailors. So, we'll get back to you. More updates once the game starts. So, see you guys. Hey, babe, I love fried chicken, and somehow I love you more. I love you more. It's true, babe, my crispies and nahim, but you, you're the perfect score. You're the perfect score. Hey, babe, I love fried chicken, and somehow I love you more. It's true, babe. My crispies are nine, but you, you're the perfect score. Well, the older I get, might have to watch my weight. I'll turn down the upsize meal. Alright, so Gabriel is coming off for half pistol. He has played a good game. Uh, good assist, good passes. Alright, half pistol will bring uh, much more speed on the thing. And uh, looking at when the way to the final second game up. Uh, when the train lands on the wings. Alright, so let's do it. Come on, let's make it 5 0. He's one of We 
love you, Gabriel. We do. We love you, Gabriel. We do. We love you, Gabriel. We do. Oh, Gabriel, we love you. That's right, we do love our Gabriel Quag, right? It's 4 0. We'll update you more on when there's any changes. See you soon. Alright, so say it's just clear, it's not 4 1. Um, suspected to be our own goal, but we'll see the replays later. But well, there's still 20 more minutes. Let's just hold this and score a couple more goals and close for the win. 4 1, but we still got a chance. Right now. Ah, wasted. Ah. What a waste. Anyway, Kim Shibu is out. Uh, he got substituted with a uh, song. Suspected to have some grind issue. I hope he, he he heals before the ACL because he's our only available striker. But uh, let's wish him well and hope he recovers in time. Alright, so song is in. And he's passing the ball. Oh god, pass by Dave. Oh god, go by. Somebody got taken down in the box. Uh, should have been a penalty. You know, um, you know, but the referee didn't give it up. So what can we do? Alright, five minutes left. We are holding it at 5-1. Uh, looks like an opportunity to score one more. So we should be doing it. Other than that, we've been playing well. Uh, this this week has been a good week. Alright, uh, still got three more minutes to go. Let's go for one more.
my gosh, if we miss that, he passed into an open net and he did a flick, a flick back here go. What a goal, what a goal. It's 6-1 and we are winning. Some great goals, right? All right, that was a great goal by Max himself. His first goal of the season and a couple of assists, but that was some shit housery goal, man. A uh, back, a uh, passing in the back here into a goal, six one. All right, now Carlos Ruiz on the tag again. Oh! That was a good try. The passing was good, it was Chris, they scored good goals by many people and we can say that the undefeated has been defeated. We are finally top of the table and and right now going high into the ACL. All right, let's go next week that we have a trip to uh, Thailand for our ACL games and it's going to be a good one. Let's hope they have a good ride but for today, we are the top of the table, we have beaten Nigel Bagger 6 one Let's go guys! We hope you enjoyed this adventure. Hope to see you guys at the games. See you soon.